ice, ice, baby. What's the crack, guys? Today's cocktail is the Rusty Meal. Let's go! If you're new here, I'm the Rusty Bartender. I've been a bartender for over 20 years. Um, and this series, we're making our way through Steve the Bartender's Cocktail Guide. And I'm gonna make every single cocktail that's in this book. Okay, so Rusty Meal. It's probably a cocktail even your granddad's had. Um, traditionally, it's pretty much made with Drambuie. Um, Drambuie is a liqueur that's made with honey heather. Heather honey, is that what we call it? Or heather honey. It's a honey that's flavored with heather and it's made in Scotland. So two ingredients in the Rusty Nail cocktail, Drambuie and Scotch. Originally, I'm pretty sure the measurements of this were a one-to-one -one ratio, which is pretty sweet because Drambuie is a pretty sweet liqueur. But the Steve's recipe in his cocktail book, we're going two ounces of our blended scotch and half an ounce of our Drambuie, which is probably a more sort of balanced cocktail. Kind of like a flavored old fashioned kind of thing going on. I'm pretty sure this would be nice too if you added some bitters to it, but we're gonna keep it traditional. Blended scotch, Drambuie, ice, that's it, let's go. Add some ice to your mixing glass. And where is my measure? I'm gonna edit this out, probably. Okay, so we're gonna go half an ounce of our Drambuie. And uh, I'll tell you what, I'm pretty sure my granddad used to drink these. I'm pretty sure everybody's got a story about Drambuie in their house. I think I might've had a sip of that when I was a teenager. And uh, when you're a teenager and you're wanting something to drink out of your parents' liquor cabinet, it's probably not the best thing to go to, is it? Anyway, then we're gonna follow that with two ounces of a blended scotch. And then stir for 15 to 20 seconds. 15 to 20 seconds is a long time when you've got yourself sitting here thinking about life. Maybe it's time for me to ask you to like and subscribe if you haven't already. Anyway. That seems to be stirred nicely. Give it a little taste. Yeah, it's gonna be good. Okay, we're just gonna stir that into, or strain it into a old fashioned glass. And as you've seen earlier, I had a nice cube of clear ice. And strain this over. Now, traditionally, this cocktail doesn't actually need a garnish, but I used to work in a bar that was owned by Guinness back in the day. And uh, the customers in there always had a little bit of orange just over the top of it. Made it smell nice. So I'm gonna carry on that tradition. Express your oils. Just rim it around the glass. Discard. And there you go. The rusty nail. One sip, everybody knows the rules. Delightful. Yep, I think any more than half an ounce and this would be a very, very sweet drink. Even at half an ounce, this is more on the sweet side of my, my liking for these kind of type of drinks. But this is really good. Really get the heather coming through in the Drambuie. And you can see why your granddad might have liked this drink. Anyway, cheers guys. Here's the next one.